Get out of there, folks. I am Beanie. You're watching Beanie Draws. And this is more of a joking video. I'm going to call this the loudness challenge or something like that. Basically, I was going to do some proper tutorials today, but <laughs> with all this sound, obviously that's not going to happen. So, um, before I start, here's the challenge. See if you can watch through to the entire end of this video. Comment below if you made it through right to the end. And for this video, I'm just going to try and draw a Voltorb. So, uh, let's see if I can actually manage to do a tutorial while there's people jackhammering in the apartment next door. I'm a little bit annoyed because I want to do some proper tutorials, but hey, let's make something fun and entertaining out of this. See if we can actually survive through this. Because God knows I don't know if I'm going to be able to. Okay. To draw a Voltorb, you draw a circle. So let us draw a circle. So with a video like this, who needs a backing track? So in lots of tutorials you'll hear like, you know, nice calm music as someone commentates on what they're doing. You'll hear some dubstep if it's a time-lapse video. We don't need anything like that. We've got metal. Yeah. So we have drawn ourselves a circle. We have ourselves some jackhammering. Now what we need to do is divide our circle in half. So let us do that by drawing a line between our circle. is a curved semicircle line. That is what a circle or ball would look like if it was cut in half. Kind of. Now, let us do the dividing line between the eyes. Eh. Did you manage to do that? Oh look, I think they've quietened down. It won't last for long. Now is the quiet part of the tutorial. Oh, wait, no, spoke too soon. Okay, now, let's just draw the frowny lines of Voltorb's eyes. Eh. And. Eh. And. Eh. And. Eh. Voltorb starting to look exactly how I'm feeling with this jackhammering going on. Now, let's complete Voltorb's eyes. Eh. And. Eh. Did you manage to do that? Now, let's do the other eye. Eh. A line like that. And. Eh. A line like that. Now complete the eye by doing this. There we go. We've made a bit of a mess. Let us clean this up. Now, what we want to do is complete a little line there. Now, just for the sake of completion, let's give him some pupils. He has very slitty looking pupils. So, let's give him some very slitty looking pupils. We'll draw a line here. And let's draw some lines here. Which would be the shine marks on his head. Hopefully I'm not being too loud. Let me know if I'm being too loud for your ears. I apologize in advance. I'm going to clean up this image. Um, let's just draw some shine. I'm going to draw a shape for the shine there, a shape for the shine here, and a big glowy section here, which would be a shine. Now, we will go over all of this with felt tip marker. So, let us go over our messy pencil lines 
Where's the felt tip marker? Still with me? Have you managed to make it through so far? There's not much of this video left to go. I think you can do it. I believe in you. There is one of his angry eyes. Two of his angry eyes. Like so. Oh look, it's gone quiet again. Not for much longer though. I'm just gonna draw the slits in his eyes. Oh god, that's for I'm going. I'm so going to enjoy it when it's quiet again. I can actually draw properly because I've got a whole bunch of tutorials that are going to be coming along soon, but uh, that's not going to be happening. While it's quiet, I'm just going to complete as much of the rest of this image as I can. I wonder how long the jackhammer is going to go for. They may have completed the work, but let's just let's just finish this tutorial. <laughs> This tutorial is obviously just a joke, it's uh, not intended to be a real tutorial. But uh, I figured I'd make it a little bit of a... A little bit of a light-hearted joke. Out of the, make, a, um, make something funny out of a crappy situation. So, there's the bottom of his eye. I am really bad at drawing circles, and I should have a protractor or a... a um, one of those things that you, 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 you hook up your pen into a holder that makes a circle, but um, let us just complete a circle, going with a 0.8 millimeter, and I'm going to call this the noisy challenge, just for a bit of clickbaity goodness, and obviously I went for a Voltorb because uh, hey, it's a circle with eyes, and a cross section there. He should be fairly easy to draw, other than the eyes section. The eyes could be a bit challenging for some people, but, uh... Oh! Sounded like they were starting with, um, the jackhammering again. There, like I said. Oh! There it is! Now, for the hardest part of this tutorial. Colouring him in. We're going to draw one side of him red and one side of him white. Let us begin. As you can see here, I'm just adding a little bit of shadow to the other side of Voltorb so he looks more like a ball. Just going to tidy it up a little bit so it doesn't look so messy. Not that we should really worry about making this tutorial any good, but uh, hey, why not? I apologize. I, 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 I'm sorry. I apologize to your eardrums in advance. And just for the hell of it, I'm just going to put in a little bit of blue, just for a bit of shadow. Okay, now to tidy up my line work. Let me know in the comment section if you actually made it all the way through. <laughs> if you did, you are glutton for punishment. But um, yes, that is how to draw a Voltorb. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If your eardrums are now dead, let me know. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Cheerio for now.